Hey, I'm Matt from Light Bicycle, and today we're going to be lacing a true tubeless rim. Tubeless rims are tubeless ready without tape. This is because they have no access holes at the top, so traditional wheel building methods aren't going to work here. So there's a few different approaches. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the magnet approach. So some of the stuff you're going to need are the rim itself, a hub, the appropriate length spokes, nipples, two millimeter threaded screw, and a magnet. And we found that the Park Tool internal cable ones work great. All right, so the first thing you want to do is find a rubber glove and chop the finger off of it, and then put the magnet inside of there. If you don't have a rubber glove handy, electrical tape works great as well. You basically just don't want to be scratching up the rim. So when you start lacing the wheel, you're going to start the same way that you would on any other wheel. And that's by finding your key spoke on the hub. And you can see our other lacing video because it's the same program there. It's also a two cross wheel that we're doing today. So once you've found that, you're going to line it up just like you would on any other wheel. Figure out where you're going with the spoke. And then the tricky part starts where you put nipples in. All right, so when you start inserting the nipples into the rim, yeah, they all have to go through the valve hole. So you want to make sure you have your steel insert screwed into the nipple and your magnet handy. So when you put the nipple in, have the magnet on the side here so that you can catch the insert. And once you've found it, you drag it along the side to the spoke hole that you are going to be threading. And then pulling it down, the steel insert should come out first. And then you just want to be careful on this part that you don't lose the nipples. Then you simply unthread the steel insert and then rethread the spoke into that hole. So you just continue inserting nipples with the steel insert into the valve hole and bringing them to your desired nipple hole. Uh, the reason we're going along the side of the rim like this is because on our rims that's where it's the thinnest and therefore the magnet's going to have the most power. To learn more about tubeless versus tubeless ready rims, visit our blog post listed in the description. Thanks for watching.